How do you feel about your match against uh, Warble? It was way. fun. <laughs> People seemed to be into it, which which was nice. I'm not really sure why, but uh, yeah, there's there's some funny stuff. He did that crazy edge guard on Randall. That was sick. He read me like a book. Let's see next we're getting Billy Boy and Salvo. I only see Salvo like at one of our turnings uh -huh. so far. I'm pretty sure like he's been playing for a while. I know he plays Mart. He has some good spaces too. And we have Billy Boy that's been. I lives in San Diego, but goes to school in Penn State. Uh huh. So. Okay. Press one if you can hear us. Are we? Are we live? I think we're back. We're back online. Oh, okay. Everything's cool. Fine. Wow. Ha ha. A JV two. Good <laughs> Wobbles has won a national. Uh, no, are you talking about Evo no. South 2007? That was not a national. I think he was talking about like Wobbling has won a national. What national? I don't want to talk about that. This is Marth Fox, a very different matchup from Falco Ice Climbers. Uh, so yeah, Billy Boy, um, I played him in teams. He, he was very solid. Uh, he teamed with Zach, aka Sad Daddy. Um, he played, yeah, all Fox. And Sabo, you said he. I was here at one turning. Uh huh. And it's pretty good. All right, so this should be a good match. Both players are pretty good. Of course, a lot of people are pretty good. The range of skills for uh, pretty goodness is very high. Yeah. Very it's like a quote unquote mid level players, you know. I think 90% of people in the world are mid-level players. Uh, ooh, that reversed. Wow, okay, good coverage. Even stocks, ooh. Challenging the invincibility of Billy Boy did not work out there. Yeah, so uh, Yoshi's story as a strike stage is sort of a newfangled thing. You know, it used to be, this is Marth's dream stage. But foxes are kind of saying, you know what? I can kill you pretty early here. So let's let's do that. And I have a feeling that Billy Boy does not like Battlefield. I played him earlier. And really? He, yeah, he struck, he struck Battlefield. And then second game, he struck Battlefield again. Huh. And the fox did so yeah, the fox did Well, yeah. yeah. I mean, Fox has reasons to not like Battlefield. Such as uh, his uppy being a little bit awkward. True. But it's kind of awkward here, too. Randall not coming to Billy Boy's aid. He got hit off a little bit too early. But he's, he's sort of controlled the pace of the match thus far, I think. Uh, he spent a lot of time sort of in that center stage area. Okay. Double shine there was kind of interesting. I feel like you could have maybe just shine grabbed. I feel like Salvo could have punched that. So just oh, out. oh, what a read. Mm, Salvo's punishes haven't been super great off these grabs. He's got, the fact that he's gotten so many grabs in sort of separate situations is both a good sign and a bad sign. Oh my goodness, the dash dancing is so real. Ooh, the left and up air. And a stylish Ford B off the stage. Such BM. How can Sabo take that? Let's see where he's going. Oh, Battlefield. Maybe he has the knowledge that Billy Boy despises this stage. Let's see if it works out any better. All right. I'm going to be watching out for Billy Boy killing himself. Um, if he does that, then our theory is confirmed. Ooh, that's not good. Oh, okay. Ooh, nice. They did out the grab. Marth Killer, back air. Ooh, he might be able to... Yeah, he's definitely in range of the stage to do something. Mm. I don't think that was what he wanted to do. I think there, you don't try and hit the fox onto the ledge, because if you do that, then you're in lag and you can't actually get onto the stage. 
and he sort of just accomplished what he wanted to do in the first place. Oh no, a flub. Ooh, wow. I did not think he was gonna go straight, and apparently neither did Sabo. Oh. Ooh. <laughs> okay. Ah. Sweet spot. Yeah. All right. Even stocks. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Both of these guys have been calling out the spot dodges. What a delight. So many grabs in this one game. Yeah. Another grab game, man. Dia Dave. Ah. Oh. That's not fair. Uh. Box him out. Oh no. Yeah, Sabo hasn't been able to get much done this match. He's only gotten a few hits and hasn't been converting too hard off of those. Billy Boy is just sort of dash dancing circles around him. Mm, yeah, yeah, like a couple grabs thrown onto the platform, but hasn't gotten the right chase. Okay. Uh, uh, up throw forward smash at 40%. I don't know. I, I, I do think Sabo's punish game could use a little bit of work. Oh! What a call out. I, I feel like he did not predict that forward B and he was just trying to hit him off the ledge. But, you know, nevertheless, cover that option, so. He's just doing a visibility type. <laughs> oh, 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 counter? Jump down. Oh! Oh, what? Oh, no, oh. what? There's just different ledge? Uh, yeah, I guess. Bloody. That would have been hard to time. That's true. I, I would have maybe gone for like ledge hop counter or something. That was a nice drop down for Billy Boy to make that follow up of the counter like harder. Yeah, that'll do it. Good stuff by Billy Boy. He's gonna move on to winner's round four where he has in his way, uh, presumably somebody seated pretty high. So we'll see how he does there. But Sabo moving down to loser's bracket. I think he might be playing you next. Uh, that is possible? I don't think so. Your third seed? Uh, I was the second seed. Second seed? Second seed, sorry. No, right, well, whatever the case, we'll see. We'll see what goes on there. All right, I see. Tope versus Sat Daddy? Tope and Sat Daddy. Whoa, how far are we? This must be pretty late in the bracket. This is quarters, I believe. Oh, I am playing Billy Boy. Oh, there you go. Hey guys, so, YCZ here. Oh, let me. That should be better. Yeah, this will be best of three winners quarters. So Toad versus Set Daddy. Wow. Um, probably gonna see. I don't know what matchup is this gonna be. Cheek Fox. Cheek Fox. Sure. I, I don't know what character Zach plays. Really, I, he can do anything as far as I'm concerned. He plays Fox Sheep. He used to play Falco. He used to play Falco? Okay. So I, I I do remember seeing his Falco. I wasn't sure if he still played it or not. No, I think he dropped it. Okay. Did he play Puff? Am I imagining that? Um. All right, whatever. Looks like we're getting into it. Game one, Fountain of Dreams. Uh, kind of an interesting pick. I would have expected this to be more favorable for Sheik. But yeah, maybe uh, Sat Daddy does not want to fight Tope on Battlefield. Uh, and Tope with a crazy little conversion there. Up smash to forward air. Takes that stock real quick. <gasps> Alright. Wave dash out of shield. Shine. <laughs> oh, man. These guys are slugging it out already. Three stocks apiece. Forward air off the stage, and yeah, that's going to be it. Not the best of DI, I think, on Zach's part. <gasps> oh! <laughs> Tope kind of laughs it a little bit. Man, where have you been a minute? And four, right down to two stocks each. 
Yeah, you gotta pay attention, man. There's there's a lot going on right now. A lot of down airs from Sad Daddy. A smash up there. Tokens to get down. Not like that. Uh, ooh, okay. So, Zach actually covered Tope up being straight up, but Tope actually went to the stage that time. High level stuff, guys. Ooh. Alright, so Sad Daddy back in the lead. Or in the. Oh, okay. Game all tied up. <laughs> This is some exciting action here, folks. Oh, shine off the stage, Tope. Oh, what an option. Oh, wow. I can't believe he made it back. Oh, 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 what? Holy crap. This is some next level recovery. Yeah, and Tope is gonna make it back. Oh, no. Just chose the wrong option once there. Got jabbed. And Fox says, that's all I need, man. Thank you for the stock. Uh. <sighs> Remember, this is a best of three, so. Uh, yeah, and Tope going back to Fountain. He was saying, you know, I thought that stage was pretty good for me. But I mean, even with those three quick kills, Sad Daddy just got the hits where he needed them. Uh, wow, okay. Oh man, dude, okay, so that that back air, I, I've i never been able to do that. The like rising hard hit back air that sends away from the stage after the uppie. I don't know, it, it just seems like it shouldn't work. And yet it does. So, I don't know, there you go. What do I know? Oh, to oh, okay. Didn't commit too hard there. Ooh, a little early on the dash attack. Gets another knockdown. <coughs> oh. Oh. Forward air. That should pretty much do it. Yeah. Yeah, it's crowded in here. A lot of people. What's the most that we've ever had at one of these? Uh, I think this one West Balls came and I was like, this is the most? This is the most? 50 something? I'm pretty sure. I have 54, I believe, but this is definitely the. Hey man, I guess I'm just popular. Yeah, guy. 54. Ah, oh, okay, so tied with the West Balls one. <laughs> oh, Kappa. All right, well, oh, Ty was making that shitty joke. Ty himself. All right, uh, while we were talking about stuff, Tope has dropped down to a two-to-one deficit. Oh, oh, my God, what is going on over there? Uh, I'll tell you what's going on here on Fountain of Dreams, though. Tope is kind of getting pushed around a little bit. Yeah, Sat Daddy. It seems like he kind of figured it out a little bit. All right, I gotta use the restroom. All right. And Zach will take that one. 2 0, comfortable. All right, we got a historical chart of uh, last stock SD attendance. This is this So is, the this attendance the was at the West Bowls one, it was 50. So this is okay. definitely the most we've ever had in this. Wow, there you go. West Bowls is in. It was over a year ago. Uh, like. October, not October. Whatever month August. that is. Yeah, August yeah. 2015. It's confusing because Octo is a, you know. Yeah, don't worry. I, I don't know any of the months. Don't. Oh, yeah. You still, should, still you should really school. like learn those. Still in high school. I haven't learned that. Okay. I think that's first grade curriculum? No, no. N names you, you, you in their order? Yeah, I haven't. I'm not at that level yet. Yeah. It's confusing. You have to hope you don't learn those at the same time as like, you know, prefixes and stuff. Because the octo, sept, non, deck, all of those are. Uh, oh, what the fuck! Oh, all right. Some crazy stuff is going on on a setup over there. Okay. 
Uh, all right, so we got Ty and that other guy who was on stream earlier, whose name I definitely know, Shelly, right? That's Shelly. Awesome. All right, I know top players. Did they just turn pause off and then turn it back on? I'm so confused. Maybe Ty wants to quit out of wobbles. Oh, they're doing a hand warmer. Okay, very smart. <sighs> All good here. Man, look at these guys making the guest commentate. This is a nice overlay. I like it a lot. Very clean. Props to whoever Thank did you. this work. Is that you? Uh, I did. I did the. Me and Koji set up the characters. Like I, uh -huh. I, I, I cut out the characters and I kind of drafted that up. Koji, yeah. Koji got the code working. It was based off of this existing code for stocks, but uh, this was by our the designer we hired, who I believe was Tiff. I really don't want to get that wrong, but I, I don't remember who made the overlay. Koji, if he was here, you would know. Where are you, Koji? Come He's back. He's NorCal. Oh. Now that's what I call uh, ironic. Because I'm here instead of in NorCal. Okay, yeah, so they turned pause off. So that was, in fact, intentional. Good shit. All right. Get into game one. Battlefield, pretty typical. Uh, let's see if Shelly is able to get those grabs on the Arizona monster that is Ty. Oh, Tipping an illusion, tipping an ice climber. TAI. Oh, Popo has yet to hit Marth. That 2% is only from, never mind. Couple jabs. Oh, okay. Yeah, Shelly's gonna have a hard time now. Yeah, a lot of time against ice climbers, you have to like sacrifice a little bit of position or take a hit in order to kill Nana. And as the as the pro player, you have to recognize when that's happening and um, try and fish for that edge guard situation. And that time, Shelly was not able to capitalize. Oh, that grab was crazy! Wow, Shelly has a nice movement. I'm, I'm pretty impressed. But Ty saying, "Yeah, nice movement on stage, but I'm still gonna spike you. Come and get it." So Ty, Ty is what? Fourth on the AZPR. Ooh, nice conversion into the wobble. Uh, so wait, so yeah, the, the AZPR is weird because it's just like which of these, you know, five or six old school gods is still active, and then Ty, and then assorted other players. So yeah, I think Taj was active this last period. Axe definitely was. Wobbles was not, but Wobbles is. I forget where Wobbles is. Probably not Daisy. According to the AZ cover photo, it is Ty is ranked at number five. Okay, so it's Axe, Meds, Forward, Todd, Ty. Okay, makes sense. So Ty in fifth in AZ. AZ, a strong region. If Ty is fifth, I mean, top five AZ could definitely take a lot of other regions. SD trying to defend their pride here at last stock. Do you know why Ty is uh, in the area? I have no clue. Oh. I, I can ask him later, but I just, I just don't know. I'll just ask him right now. I'm, I'm sure he's, you know, he's got a comfortable lead. He should probably wouldn't mind. Yeah. I wonder if you can counter that blizzard. I don't know. I, I just I, thought I of that. Really it seems like it might be a good idea. I guess the question is, how do you like get in a position? You have to sort of like fall into it and counter with its uh, floaty properties. Sort of. Ooh! he needs to get down to the stage, but he's not going to be able to do so. Oh! I was going to say before Nana gets killed, but Ty is saying, why don't we cut out the middleman, literally, and uh, send Popo flying. Dreamland. Hmm. Interesting. Well, looks like Shelly wanted some space to uh, move around that sword. The Nana Pult uh, doesn't do a whole lot. Oh no! Ty not messing around. Not trying to let Shelly have any time to up the Nana back to the stage.
Oof. Hmm, okay. Oh! That's the uh, PPU setup, right? Uh, short hop up air into forward, into, sorry, neutral B. Uh, I shouldn't call it the PPU setup. It's the one that PPU did that one time on Hungry Box. I'm sure Ty's known about that for years. Ooh, down smash, interesting choice. <gasps> that hit, and it comboed into a back air? Oh no, but he's too high. Oh wow. Yeah, Ice Climber is forward B, sort of like a cheap imitation of Mars neutral air. Oh wow. Maybe if he had rolled, he actually might have got that edge hog. That would have been crazy. Back air, okay, up tilt. That didn't look like it would hit, but Ty knows his uh, his, his setups. <laughs> okay, no punish. That's done a lot of like sort of run up forward smash in neutral to neutral ish positions. Either, you know, has a read on Shelly where he's not respecting his out of shield game and Shelly says, Hey, I I got I got jab grabs. I don't know how to play this character. Down smash definitely should kill by now. Oh! Uh. Uh oh. That is not what we want to see. Okay, not takes doesn't take too much punishment, but Shelly does, does not look super enthused about what just happened. Then again, oh no. Definitely does not look super enthused about that. So Ty now with the full stock lead. Oh wow! Straight into the wobble, not messing around at all. So you're gonna do unsafe variables on my shield? Get out of here. All right, let's let's hope he can get a better conversion out of it than this than last time. Okay, so it does the down throw up smash, and about even. Nana has a little bit of percent, I think. Ah, I hope that dash dance desync. I don't want to do that. Oh, Nana! That was sick. Nana ledge canceled the up B. That was disgusting. Ooh, I think he uh, was a little off in his desync because he did a down B with Popa, which is something you usually don't want to do because it forces Nana to do one also. <gasps> Ooh, almost hit him with the day two roll behind grab. <laughs> oh, nice. Nice decision making there by Ty. Uh, ran up, saw that Shelly was shielding, and decided to just hit Nana. But Shelly doing a really good job, um, keeping this pretty even through the second stock, making Ty respect his his uh, his punishes. <gasps> Ooh. Yeah, ledge wave dash down smash. Ooh, yeah, Ty giving Shelly a lot of space now, trying to, you know, sort of give him a rough, enough rope to hang himself, as they say. Shelly going for the wave dash and dance masters completely with. Mm. Okay, so Shelly hits that. Get him. And last stock. Oh, Nana, what are you doing? Don't mess around now. Oh, whoa. That was... What did he even desync with? I did not even see. Oh, that's brutal. You have to just watch your Nana fall off the stage and die as Marth puts you in the chokehold. And yeah, that'll be it. Ty takes a set 2-0. There's a little bit of a scare there, but Shelly ends up taking uh, the loss. All right, looks like I'm about to play. Wish me luck. Good luck. All right. Sway back on. What's up? Unfortunate. Biggest slash talk ever, and me and Junior still have to play first, like our first round of losers. Wait, chat. How did uh, Ty and Ty and Shelly go? <coughs> All right, I have to. What's up, Mega John? What's up, Blue? All right, I have to tweet out real quick.
Michael Tran.